Blackout. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right, guys. Um, does anybody have any notes for Kathy? What are they wearing? Um, it's just a robber, so I thought like a black hoodie could be easily yeah. done. Yeah, yeah, we can get one. He could wear a fedora. He could also have wingtips. Mm. He could wear a trench coat. Have him wear a trench coat. So your pitch is for Kathy's character to wear a trench coat? That's correct. Why? Because trench coats are eye-catching. They add intrigue and are badass. I think you're just adding trench coats to whatever because you're really into them right now. Nah, I don't see how the two are related. Well, because you just started very bombastically wearing trench coats and are now suggesting that we put trench coats in all of our sketches. Well, see, Zach, that's correlation, not causation. And if you want to be an adult like the rest of us, you're going to have to learn what big words mean. Uh, if we can go ahead and read my sketch, that'd be fantastic. This first one is called Hero. Matt, if you could be stage directions. Ren, if you could be clerk. I will be Hero. Okay. Interior convenience store night. A clerk closes up shop for the night. Hero walks in. He wears a long trench coat. Hold for 10 seconds on the trench coat. It's too long. Hello. You've been upselling customers on household items. The hero pulls out a gun and shoots the clerk in the face. The clerk dies. Hold on trench coat for 10 seconds. Blackout. Any notes? No? Uh, no, yes, I have notes. Uh, we cannot just hold on a trench coat for 20 seconds. Yes, we can. It's funny. How? Because it's ironic. How is it ironic? Because the audience will realize that they themselves are not wearing a trench coat. Irony. That's not irony. And why are you talking like this? You sound like a fucking actor from the 1940s. Whatever do you mean, Zacky boy? Yeah, also, Charlie, I mean, it's not long enough. It's only half a page. Well, then we can hold for longer on the trench coat. No! I don't think we're going to agree on this one. Why don't we go ahead and read my next sketch? It's called Badass Motherfucker. Jesus. Matt, if you could do stages. Kathy, ticket taker. I will be Badass Motherfucker. Great. Interior movie theater, day. A ticket taker finishes with a customer. Enter Clyde Trenchcoat, the most bad to the bone motherfucker you've ever seen. Dressed in the coolest trench coat fucking ever. He probably has a bunch of girlfriends and also a fucking eye patch. Charlie. Hi, are you here for the 1240 showing? You've been upselling moviegoers on ticket prices. The badass motherfucker pulls out a gun and shoots the ticket taker in the face. Dude. Blackout. I've got notes. Like? Well, so first of all, it's the same sketch. Totally disagree. Also, Clyde Trenchcoat, you gotta change that name. You are fucking crazy! Charlie... Uh, Call me Charcoat! What? I've changed my name. To Charcoat? Yes. It's like Trenchcoat, but plus Charlie. That doesn't make any sense! Are you listening to yourself? This is stupid, self-indulgent non-comedy, and you're obviously just trying to shoehorn your weird fashion sense into all of these sketches. Charcoat! Yes. Charcoat thanks you for letting him pitch. Okay. Um, let's just calm down. Move on, right? Does anybody else have anything they want to pitch? You've been upselling homeowners on their water bill. Flambe!